Trucks are an essential part of a country's economy. They help in the transportation of goods and products in large quantities from one part of the country to the other, and sometimes beyond the country's borders to other nations. For many countries, this means of transportation is the only reliable intrastate transportation of bulk movement of goods. In Nigeria, most of the trucks seen on the roads are locally fabricated. So how are they able to rebuild these heavy-duty carriers to maneuver difficult terrains, ensure durability, and withstand harsh road networks? Here, at a site in Nasarawa State, Nigeria, we will find out how they are able to keep it going. Most trucks are sold bare bodies. This is to allow buyers customize them for specific purposes, such as tippers, tankers, flatbeds, or box trucks, depending on their businesses and operational needs. In this type of uh, trailer head, we have different ones. We have 10 tire, we have 6 tire. And this one, we, and we have 12 tire. This one is 10 tire. Because when you see 10 tire, you will see two tires here and one tire at the front here. When you see 12 tires head, trailer head, you will see two tires here because it's using a normal tunnel at the back and double axle at the front. Here two and here two. And we have a six tire head. It contains only one tunnel here. The fabrication of the body is the most visible part of the process. However, a thorough mechanical groundwork takes place beforehand to ensure the vehicle's stability and capacity to withstand its intended load. This one I see starting now. It first came like this, and now mechanics will start losing. They will lose those ones, these springs, to add uh, to add more frame, let him be 12 tire. Yeah, this one, I see this one, like this one. One more they will bring up, put them here. Add, let him be four tire. They will still add this frame. Add them more. Let him be long. We have different type of bodies we built. Like this one, it's trailer body. And we have different types of trailer body. This one is normal tunnel trailer body. And this one is three axle. He has three legs. This one has two legs. This one is a reserve tank. When we don't want to stay in Philly Station to put more diesel, we will, fill, we will fill, put diesel for here, full. When you reach anywhere, you can stay and lose it. There is place to lose under here. And we have hook to hold trailer head. We have hook to hold trailer, this one. is the one that holding trailer head to draw it. When they put load, can draw it to anywhere you like. While most of the process goes on, welding and fabrication cannot, without electricity. As at the point of recording this documentary, there was no electricity, bringing the production to a halt for long hours, and sometimes for many days, affecting the production in many ways. <laughs> Highest motor body which you in show me one month. I'm against him about with my bar my each year and I can add a mugama each. See the co mungama to damn the generator mona and use it to my as well as I then the bar my ears are my generator. In bar with a mona jirani cozy and cow tell me each in any in any time work can come and when that work come there is no light. Now we face that challenge because we will feel work get something to chop. And if there is no light, there is no any money that is coming to our hand, we just used to say like this, even food said to beg or go eat credit food. But electricity is not the only challenge they face. Quality material Five 
ka in yayi wawin ma sai ka iya samun karin 2000 akai ko 55000 ma to kuma kayan ba mai kyau bane har yanzu quality kayan china ne yanzu dun muke amfani abinda muke samu na ukraine kai plan ne gashi nan shi shine kai ya rage amma su china su mai na ukraine ko russia duka babu su yanzu a kasuwa many factors lead to a variation in the cost of this production such as inconsistency in the cost of materials due to inflation and exchange rate now they the body for 12 tire it reach 8.5 8.3 the trailer body for it reach 22 million to 23 complete body before before you come do paint and wiring small small decoration maybe you go take 30 million only head go one a legacy One of the most important processes in rounding up this mechanism is to ensure there is enough air available for the vehicle. Most heavy-duty trucks like this uses air brakes instead of hydraulic brakes. Air suspension system to adjust ride height, improve stability, and enhance load handling, as well as honking, cooling, and ventilation. Another unique and significant part of this entire process is the painting. This goes beyond the application of liquid color onto the vehicle. There are messages and diagrams that cautions, encourages, and some of worship, such as love one another, trust and obey, horn before overtaking. This business is capital intensive, but profitable to all involved along the chain. Johanna has been driving trucks for 25 years. But only the first 6 years did he drive someone else's. If your motor day is okay, you can go Lagos come back. If na Abuja, you go fee see like 800 or 1 million naira a week. If all the time you are seeing goods to carry to Lagos or Patako, you go fee see I more you go fee get like 3 million naira. if there is no any problem so man they get 4 million naira the drivers of this vehicles have made highways their home driving for days from one state to another like every other business there are challenges our major problem road no good because, you know no say you go see you do the work you go see because of road one motor get us them for road we we they stay for a uh, for outside like two months before you come back if you want to if you work in the night if your man show you that there is something wrong if you not show you may you just work you go in park and sleep inside the motor we just do this in this motor you know get this thing now from this nigeria we do this uh, our this method we just do this one see our pillow where we buy we put if you want to sleep you go arrange them like this you go just lie down and sleep see the see this bed for under here any time when we reach if you wanted to sleep this is our motor boy now here he go put mass and sleep here any time if na in the night na here motor boy they sleep for front driver that sleep for front motor boy they sleep here high yes, even at three more we dey outside na here the the motor boy they sleep as a means of quality checking The finished truck will be fully loaded with heavy items to travel for over 800 kilometers distance. When the trip is complete, withstanding the load and distance, another big body is welcomed to the highway. And this is how they manage to keep it going. If you are interested in these kinds of stories, kindly subscribe and tap the notification button to get notified on all our stories. Follow at Africa Stitches on all social media platforms.